up? Welcome to my new video. Today's video is going to be a very chill and relaxed and just chill video. So I'm currently wearing my spirit jersey that my big got me for my birthday and I'm just chilling in it right now because it's super comfy and today's video is going to be super chill as well. I'm going to be showing you guys my everyday makeup routine. This is what I do every day when I go to school or if I'm going out and like I really don't want to do a whole bunch of makeup. I hope you guys enjoy it and let's get into the video. What was that? The first thing I'm going to do is prime my face with this IT Cosmetics number 50 Serum Collagen Veil Anti-Aging Primer. Something that I really like about this primer is just how it makes your skin feel. It makes it feel super hydrated, soft like a baby's bottom, and I really like it. So, so first thing I do, I'm going to be using my Maybelline Superstay Better Skin Foundation. I just did a review on this. If you guys want to see it, I will link it right here, and it will also be in the cards and the description box below. And I just really like this foundation just because of how light it is, and it's just really easy to put on. And and then I just kind of dot it all over my face. The brush that I use to blend it in is the It Cosmetics Brush uh, Blurring Foundation Air Brush number 101. And this is the It Cosmetics line for Ulta. The good thing about this brush is that you can use it as a stippling brush or just like a buffing brush. And I don't know, I really like it just because it's so versatile and you can use it for like anything. And then what I use for powder is the Rimmel Stay Matte Long Lasting Press Powder. And this one is in the color 20 Nude Beige. For the brush for my powder, I use the Loathe Beautifully It Cosmetics for Ulta brush in, what is it? number 211 all over powder and then sometimes i just wanted to tell you guys instead of the foundation i will use the laura mercier tinted moisturizer with spf 20 it is the lightweight flora flawless yeah lightweight flawless coverage and i don't know what color this is um this is nude this is really light for me, or not super light, but it's relatively light. And I have it in the light shade because I usually use this in the winter, and in the winter I get white, like really white. So, and then if I'm feeling like fancy, I'll use the e.l.f. Golden Bronzer in the shade Golden, and I will just use like the contour shades and kind of go try contour my cheeks doesn't go too well because I don't really have cheekbones because I have really chubby cheeks but hey it's the thought that counts guys sometimes I take the exact same brush which is the look beautifully line uh, number 227 flawless blush brush and I take the highlighter shade and highlight my cheek and my nose, and my cupid's bow, and my chin, and sometimes I'm on my forehead. Then, I usually vary from my Maybelline Brow Drama Sculpting Brow Mascara, or brow gel, I feel weird calling it brow mascara, or my e.l.f. eyebrow kit. This is what I'm gonna use today, because I love this, and I usually set it with this. So I'm gonna show you guys how we do my eyebrows. Um, I'm using this angled liner brush, from the Live Beautifully line, and it's called the number 217 Angled Liner Brow Brush. I'm just gonna grab this like pomade. I'm just gonna fill in my eyebrows. I usually start towards like the bottom, and I build the product up, and then I just go towards like the end of my eyebrow and fill that in.
I don't really fill them in too much for school or anything. So I'm just showing you guys exactly what I do to my eyebrows when I do go to school. And then sometimes I'll just take the brow drama brow gel and comb through my eyebrows. On a day-to-day -day basis, I don't prime my eyelids because I'm only going to school for about four hours and then I usually just come home and do like online school work. So I don't really do that. The eyeshadow palette that I'm going to be using today is like my favorite palette ever. It is the Lorac Pro palette. And today I'm going to be using these three shades, Champagne, Gold, Champagne, Gold, and Light Bronze. And then for my crease, sometimes I use Taupe. So I'm gonna mix Champagne and Light Bronze and put that all over my eyelid. I'm using this kind of like as a base and I'm also going into the inner corner just to brighten up my eyes. On top of that, I'm going to put the shade Gold. And then I'm going to be taking the color Taupe just very lightly and putting it into my crease. It's barely gonna show up because I'm literally barely tapping it in here. Curl my eyelashes. With, I totally forgot what this um, curler's from or where this curler's from. I think it's Revlon. I don't even know. You guys know this, I have like the derpiest eyelashes ever. I talk about this in like every single one of my videos. Just because my eyelashes do not hold a curl at all. Like, I've done everything possible to hold a curl and it just doesn't happen. So, just wanna let you guys know again. And then the mascara I'm using is my favorite mascara and it is the Voluminous Carbon Black Mascara. And I have about five of these around my house because I love them so much and I usually do like a really light coat just something like this and this mascara is so dark it just makes your eyelashes look so full and voluminous hence um, the name I'm like a mascara like junkie like I own so many mascaras but this has probably been my favorite one to this day, I thought I was obsessed with the Lancome Hypnose Mascara. Not until I found this one. Or until I found this one. I got this mascara because Allison Loves JB always talks about this mascara and it was a lash accelerator and it has Grow Lash Complex in it. I didn't know that. But I just got this and I really like it for my lower eyelashes. The brush is relatively small and it just has really small bristles so it's really good to get into your lower lashes and I'm just gonna coat them really lightly Oh, look at that. Tiffany finally has eyelashes. Yay. And I'm just going to take my Vaseline Lip Therapy Creme Brulee and just put that all over my lips. <laughs> and that is it for my everyday makeup tutorial. Yay. It's super easy. Really just easy to do. This is what I wear practically every single day to school and I hope you guys take this as like an inspiration of what you guys could wear to school. I do go to college and I do wake up with like 15 minutes to get ready. So I do everything super quick. I plan my clothes the night before. If you guys wanna see like 
my everyday just like vlog. I would love to do that just to show you guys what I do every single day. If you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe right here or you can just press a little button down there. The other thing is follow me on social media because I am always Snapchatting, tweeting, Instagramming, just having fun and talking to you guys. Shout out to Mia Stammer and Sierra Furtado. I just met them this weekend and they were total sweethearts. I went to their girls night in tour and it was just really fun and me and my little sister Camila, which you guys have seen in other videos, stayed until like they got on their tour bus. Sierra and I and like a big group of girls talked for about an hour and it was just really cool because we just got to talk and Sierra was a total sweetheart and then Mia like followed me on Twitter and she said she would check out my my YouTube channel. So if you're doing that, Mia, thank you so much. You're like such a sweetheart. And I really hope you enjoyed my video and I love your videos and I told you that. So yeah, I'm actually going to insert some of those pictures in here. I think that's it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.